I'll figure out the processing power we'll need to run our localized servers and report it to IT. Better yet, you do it. Copy. And what about the open source coding seminar? Oh, I know what's important. I don't have the time. Here's an idea. I'll do it. Let me take the lead on this one, Sean. You're way out of your element here. Make it quick, gentlemen. Thank you for taking the time to speak with us, sir. My name is Gus Brown, and this is my associate, Sean White. Wow. We're personal friends of Leonard Callahan, and we're wondering if someone here could help us with one of his encrypted files. I doubt it. Leonard was the best we had. No one could break his encryptions. He even had patents on them. I can't even figure <laughs> out what he was working on before he died. I don't suppose either of you can create an 802.1Q spanning tree loop using auto-forwarding non-Wintel-based equipment. I can make a straw wrapper crawl like a worm. Oh, and uh, make the inside of my elbow look like a butt. Thank you for your time. Dude, it's Diddle's cubicle. Maybe there's a clue there about what was on that encrypted file. It's just what I was thinking, Gus. Wow. This guy's almost as organized as you are. Those other two brothers, they couldn't color tab their way out of a steakhouse. Really? Now you're on them because they're not anal retentive I'm enough? I'm just saying. What happened between you guys? Move on, Sean. Dude, I've always wanted to do this. So important about those addresses. It's interesting. What? Your boy like big butts, and I cannot lie. What are you talking about, Sean? Looks like Diddle. Had a little stalker in him. Diddle was a saint, Sean. Don't talk about him like that. Oh, I'm not mad at him. Excuse us. We were never formally introduced. I'm world-renowned psychic Lothario Sean Spencer. This is my associate. Gus. But you can call me John Slade. I'm Chelsea. I'm getting a psychic transmission right here as we speak, Chelsea. A fleeting glance. A Stolen moment between co-workers. Leonard had a little thing for you, didn't he? How'd you know that? It's a psych psychic. I'm sorry. I could always tell you know, the way he'd hold the door for me or offer to help carry my files. And he finally got up the nerve to ask me out right before he, uh... He was very sweet. You don't meet many guys like that these days. Oh, there, there. I know how you feel. Do you recall anything unusual about his final days? Oh, we just started talking. I never got to know him all that well. He sure loved his music, though. Always humming or riffing on songs over there in his cubicle. Talking about some group he used to sing with back in college. A cappella. I was a part of that group, but... Anyway, if you could think of anything else, or if you just need someone to talk to, please, feel free to give us a call. This is my work card, but my personal cell number's on the back. Thank you. No. Thank you, Chelsea. All right. Dude, you realize it's the third variation of my work card with my some other number on the back and pencil move that you've used this month alone? It's called showing off my penmanship, Sean. Ancient culture saw it as a sign of virility. 